I can tell you this much, this thing is hard to get out. First little bolt right there, simple as hell. And I gotta disconnect this little thing. So I can move this around with the one in the back. Good luck. You gotta put the ratchet down in there and slide it in. And then try to make sure you got the right length of extensions and try to come up with a combo where it ends around there so you can get your ratchet on it. Boy, it took a while to find that out. Whew. Man, ridiculous. Oh, gosh, this thing is stupid difficult. Alright, get that out of there. And then I'm going to undo this one and then finish that one in the back. Luckily, I got that uh, that 14 millimeter on there. Whew. And it was really on there. But that thing is junk. So, I'll let you know. Make sure you take the 12 millimeter off. I'll never get a socket in there. So I'll just use a wrench. All right. Stand by. Whew. I can tell you that if your ratchet comes off, man, you're fucked. It's hard to get back on. I've been using vice grips to turn this last little bit. If you could see, I don't know if you could see. Let's see. Look. Where is it at? There. There you go. You can see the last little bit of the bolt. Motherfucker won't come out, man. Such a bitch. It's a fucking. Nightmare. Because look, whatever the fuck they put on these fucking bolts, I guess it was Loctite. This last little bit, my god. If that's not Loctite, then it's just fucking pure corrosion. The bitch has been in there since 98. <laughs> so that's, uh,. It's like 30 years. No, 20 years. 20 years, man. It's been in there for 20 years. Whew. This is a job. Looking back, I probably would have paid someone to do it. But, whatever. I like a little bit of a challenge, as long as you don't need it right away, you know? Luckily, I got a backup truck, so... <laughs> bitch is moving. It's moving. It's fucking moving so fucking slow, though. Whew. Kills my hands, man. Cramping up and shit, you know? I'll have to come back to it a little bit at a time. So I can't get the ratchet in there. I really tried all little angles. It's because of that stupid ass condenser line, that fucker. A little bit at a time, I'll get it. Persistence. Just patience and you'll get it. Oh, this bitch holds to the very last thread. Oh, fucking, excuse my language, but my God. Whew. They give you no room. Right that little corner. Right there, fucking hit your knuckle. Oh my god. It's a fight, man. You gotta keep walking back and forth. I'll tell you, my hand hurts. Come on. Get off. Do it for Facebook, man. Facebook, what the hell am I saying? I can't even fucking think. Do it for YouTube. Come on, get off of there. Do it for YouTube. You get off of there. Oh, with the left hand. The left hand's about to fall off. I wish this thing would fucking fall off. <sighs> oh my 
God. I have no idea. Look at that bolt, man. It's, it's fully stretched out. Right, right there. It's fully stretched out. Oh. Whew. Oh, my back hurts. I'll tell you, man. You guys that work on these cars. Whew. And I get fucking mad. And it still won't come off. It's still fucking jammed in there. I don't want to rip the threads off by yanking on it like that, but man, I'm getting pissed. Jeez. Get out of there. Well, folks, I got it out. It's coming out. I don't know why they said you had to take your battery tray out. That must be a different model. You know, this is an Acura CL 98, and they say it's got a 2.3, but for some odd reason, it's got all the parts to a 2.2. So anyway, screw that other bolt. I don't even care what happens. You know, it's right there. It's in my hand, so I'll put that right there, but. <clears throat> my god there's the fucking devil dude incredible well anyway there she is time to order up a new one <laughs> time to hit up ebay 44202 all right i'm gonna match that number up i've seen a couple of them on ebay so i want to make sure i got the right one you know uh, look at it carefully and make sure you get that get that number right there see you later